morning. It's currently 8 a.m. in Osaka and we're going to leave for Kyoto. I mentioned this in my other vlogs already, but I have a detailed itinerary that I made for Japan and I will link that in the descriptions if you're also planning a trip for Japan. But yeah, I'm really excited for today because on today's itinerary, we are going to start the day at this bookbinding workshop. I've been like following Tokyo Explorers on Instagram and I saw them post about this bookbinding workshop two days ago and I really wanted to do it because this is like my type of craft. <laughs> and then for the rest of the day, we're just gonna explore Gion and go to Nishiki Market. So cute. <laughs> Thoughts? Good. Is that Wendy's? It says Wendy's first kitchen. You think it's the first kitchen ever? In the world? In the world? Who's that one? 
Oh, is it the sleeping one? I think so. Mine is so big, and then there's your cute little peach. I yeah. should have gotten yours. Wait, this cake is really good though. Tokyo is definitely much better. Actually, mm -hmm. you don't like this one as much? Isn't Kyoto known for the matcha one? The matcha itself is really good, but the combination of everything at the Tokyo one, like the portions, is like the perfect amount of everything. This like has way too much mochi, beans, and jellies. At this point, you just don't want anything but the <laughs> liquid. <laughs> so many people! It looks so good! Wow. So good! p.m. We didn't do that much today, but it felt so exhausting because of the amount of crowds there were for Gion Matsuri, like their annual festival. Like it should be a 20 minute walk to get from Gion to here, but it took us over 30 minutes, maybe like 40. But I still had so much fun eating and looking at the shops. I did buy more things than I expected to. I like laid everything all pretty on the bed. <laughs> So this is my haul for today. No. <laughs> no. I got these four from Bento and Co. This from like a popular matcha dessert store. This from the really aesthetic candy store. This is some sort of pine floral sake with pineapple extracts and like other things. I forget. These are peanut candies and all of these were from B-Side Label, and I bought so many more stickers than I expected to. They're so cute though. <laughs> like, I just couldn't resist. And also, Eric convinced me. He's like, they're so cute. Like, you're never gonna find these anywhere else. So, yeah. Today is July 17th, which means that it's Gion Festival. Today, they're doing like the float festival where they have these like huge floats and carry them down the streets. So I really want to see that. It starts in half an hour, so we have to leave soon. After the float festival, we're going to just explore the area of Gion because we didn't get a chance to do that yesterday eat matcha dessert, eat strawberry dessert, and we're gonna try our best to eat at Kichi Kichi Omu Rice because I wasn't able to get a reservation, but I think there's a way to like eat there without a reservation if you wait early enough. So we're gonna try that. If not, it's okay. We'll find another place to eat for dinner, but I wanna just at least try.
So we just ate at Kichi Kichi Omu Rice and it was so good and such a fun experience. The chef is such a performer and he's like kind of a celebrity. While we were waiting in line, we met a stranger who was in front of us and ended up just like talking with him the entire time. That was definitely out of my comfort zone because I'm so introverted, but like in the end, like it was so fun. We're gonna end the night soon probably because we're so tired. <sighs> You're gonna hate this. Yeah, you're gonna absolutely hate it. Can we go to the other strawberry candy place? Yeah. You know, we should have taken a hint that this place had a huge lineup and the there's like nine did. that strawberry queen. No. So we dedicated today for nature. I think it would be nice because we've spent the first two days in the city and like I think I've explored enough of that. So dedicating today for like 
the more quiet, relaxing nature things would be nice. So we're gonna start the day going to the Arashiyama Bamboo Grove and Monkey Park, and then Kinkaguchi Temple, and then lastly, the Fushimi Inari Shrine. It's like an over 30 minute commute to the Bamboo Grove. So we're gonna leave right now and yeah. Oh, it's a tomato ball. Is it just a tomato? The tomato is good though. Yeah, it's a good tomato. You want to take a video? We just got back to the hotel and as you can see my shoulders are very burnt because I forgot to put on sunscreen. Oh my god. <laughs> ah! I only put it on my face, but I forget to put it on my body all the time. So this is like what I look like right now. It's currently 6 p.m. and we decided to end the day and just eat KFC. <laughs> We're so exhausted from walking like all around Kyoto today. How many calories did we burn walking? Okay. walking. 700? Is that what it says? 737, yeah. Yeah. A lot of walking. Looks and smells scrumptious. How'd you open it? The side too. I got the chicken filet burger, fries, and Ugh. six pieces of chicken. I'll have a fry. Dude, this is so much better than Canada. Hmm. I gotta say though, I still like Popeye's better. Because of the crunch. Mm-hmm. 
This doesn't have as much crunch, but the flavor is really good. The problem with Canadian KFCs is they grease that shit up. Oh my like, god, it, it don't even taste good. Yeah. It tastes like oil. Mm -hmm. So this like, at least doesn't taste like hella greasy. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna try this. on the rocks. Reminds me of Osmos, chicken on the rocks. That's what I think of when I hear on the rocks. But here, oh. it means with ice. That's everywhere. Okay, well, I'm gonna try my chicken sandwich. This is what it looks like. It's smaller than your average burger. Mm -hmm. I love the mayo. It's good? Mm. Just eat it. Mm. Well, that concludes our dinner. This is technically our last day in Kyoto because tomorrow we're going to Nagoya and we're going to see the castle. But most importantly, we're going to go to Ghibli Park, which I've been waiting for this entire trip. So yeah, I'm going to see you tomorrow and we'll be on our way to Nagoya. Nagoya water. But you can see the Homaru Palace, important culture garden, seasonal flowers. So we just toured through Nagoya Castle and it was really beautiful but like the main tower was closed so we couldn't go in which like is literally the main attraction but it's okay like we went into the side tower <laughs> and it was still pretty but like basically we only spent like half an hour there so now we're on our way to go to osu shopping district and we have around an hour there before we have to leave for ghibli park from anywhere. So 
these are the donuts we got from Krispy Kreme and I didn't even know they left this really cute message. We got three different flavors. This one's orange and peach. This is strawberry milk and this one is watermelon. By the way, Ghibli Park was amazing but we were only able to get tickets for the 2 p.m. time slot and that left us three hours to explore just the grand warehouse but there were so many people and I was waiting in line for like half of the entire time to get those good photo ops like that they have here at the warehouse. If you plan to go to Ghibli Park, like get the 12 p.m. time slot or like earlier because you would feel really rushed especially if you're a fan of studio ghibli like it wouldn't give you enough time to really appreciate everything you know what i mean but yeah anyways we are leaving first thing in the morning tomorrow to go back to tokyo and fly back to canada so yeah i might as well just end it here thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed this vlog or this series um, and I'll see you in my next video.